Okay, so in order to use a virtual software sensor as a uh, curve control output, you first need to create your virtual software sensor. So go into Playground, Virtual Software Centers, Sensors, and in the top right hand corner click on Add. You need to create a name for the sensor. So I'm just going to call this Test. The unit that you want to use, I'm going to be using a temperature unit, so I'm going to use, put it as a degree C, and then click the tick down the bottom. So there's the sensor output. Now we need to create the uh, values that are going to build this. So you need to click on the plus down here, and select. I'm going to select a data source in, and I'm going to select a data source. And the first thing I'm going to do is find my um, CPU temperature. So that one there. Uh, these values here are your fallback times and test values and fallback values. The fallback value is what it's set to at boot. Anyway, there's my in. I then want to add a second value in this case because I want to do a delta T. I'm going to select my data source and from the octo, from the temperature sensors, I'm going to select my ambient temperature sensor and again click this. We now need to add in a calculation. So in this case, it's uh, a subtraction. And I want to take B away from A. So A is my CPU temperature. B is my ambient. That's giving a figure now of 17.8. And then the final step in virtual software sensors is to connect back to the test sensor. The next step is you now have to add this to the octo and sensors. So you've got a number of these software sensors set up. So I'm going to pick one that I've not used yet. Uh, soft sensor seven, soft sensor eight, and I want to get the data source for that is going to be from my virtual software sensors be from my test sensor in this case and that's all you need to do there uh, you can put a multiplier on or an offset if you want and then when you go into your fan controls I'm just going to use this case fans one for the moment you change the controller source and find the one you just added so that's one two three four five six seven soft sensor 7 in this case because I didn't rename it and then that's going to use your delta T uh, for the CPU temperature.